the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. I will go unto the altar of God. Amen. And unto the God of my joy and gladness. Our help is in the name of the Lord. Lord the Lord. 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 I confess, God Almighty, blessed Mary, ever virgin, blessed Michael the Archangel, blessed John the Baptist, to the Holy Apostle Peter and Paul, to all the saints and you, brethren, that I have sent exceedingly in God for indeed. And my fault, and my own fault, and my own most grievous fault. Wherefore I beg, blessed Mary, ever virgin, Michael the Archangel, blessed John the Baptist, the Holy Apostle Peter and Paul, all the saints and you, brethren, pray for me to the Lord our God. Almighty God, have mercy upon us, forgive us our sins, and bring us to everlasting life. Amen. Amen. May the Almighty and merciful Lord grant unto us pardon, absolution, and remission of all our sins. Amen. Will thou not turn again and quicken us, O God? That thy people may rejoice in thee. O Lord, show thy mercy upon us. And grant us thy salvation. O Lord, hear my prayer. And let my cry come unto thee. O Lord, be with you. And with thy spirit. Let's pray. Almighty God, unto whom all hearts are open, all desires known, and from whom no secrets are hid. Cleanse the thoughts of our hearts by the inspiration of thy Holy Spirit, that we may perfectly love thee and worthily magnify thy holy name. Through Christ our Lord. Amen. Let the people tell the wisdom of the saints, and let the church show forth their praise. Their name shall live forevermore. Rejoice in the Lord, O ye righteous, for it becometh well the just to be thankful. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Ghost. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. Let the people tell of the wisdom of the saints, and let the church show forth their praise. Their name shall live forevermore. Lord, have mercy upon us. Lord, have mercy upon us. Lord, have mercy upon us. Christ, have mercy upon us. Christ, have mercy upon us. Christ, have mercy upon us. Lord have mercy upon us. Lord have mercy upon us. Lord have mercy upon us. Glory be to God on high, and on earth peace, good will towards men. We praise thee, we bless thee, we worship thee, we glorify thee. We give thanks to thee for thy great glory. O Lord God, the heavenly King, God the Father Almighty. O Lord, the only begotten Son, Jesus Christ. O Lord God, Lamb of God, Son of the Father that takes away the sins of the world, have mercy upon us. Thou that takes away the sins of the world, receive our prayer. Thou that sittest at the right hand of God the Father, have mercy upon us. For thou only art holy, thou only art the Lord, thou only, O Christ, with the Holy Ghost, our most high and glory of God the Father. Amen. The Lord be with you and with thy spirit. Let us pray. O God, who does vouchsafe unto us to celebrate the heavenly birthdays of thy forty holy martyrs of Sabbath, grant that we may rejoice in your perpetual fellowship in heaven. Through Jesus Christ, thy Son, our Lord, who liveth and reigns with thee in the unity of the Holy Spirit ever, one God, world without end. Amen. Let us pray. Almighty and everlasting God, who waitest nothing that thou hast made, and dost forgive the sins of all those who are penitent. Create and make in us new and contrite hearts, that we, worthily lamenting our sins and acknowledging our wretchedness, may obtain of thee the God of all mercy, perfect remission and forgiveness. Through Jesus Christ, thy Son, our Lord, who liveth and reigns with thee in the unity of the Holy Spirit, ever, one God, world without end. Amen. The lesson from the Book of Wisdom. But the righteous live forevermore, their reward also is with the Lord, and the care of them is with the Most High. Therefore shall they receive a glorious kingdom and a beautiful crown from the Lord's hand. For with his right hand shall he cover them, and with his arm shall he protect them. He shall take to him his jealousy for complete armor, and make the creature his weapon for the revenge of his enemies. He shall put on righteousness as a breastplate, and true judgment instead of a helmet. He shall take holiness for an invincible shield. Here ended the lesson. Thanks be to God. Our soul has escaped even as a bird out of the snare of the fowler. The snare is broken and we are delivered. Our help standeth in the name of the Lord, who hath made heaven and earth. Let the righteous be glad and rejoice before God. Let them also be merry and joyful. They that sow in tears shall reap in joy. He that now goeth on his way weeping and beareth forth good seed shall doubtless come again with joy to bring his sheaves with him. Lord, be 
with you and with thy spirit. Continuation of the Holy Gospel according to Luke. Glory, Glory to thee, O Lord. At that time, Jesus came down from the mountain and stood in the plain in the company of his disciples and a great multitude of people out of all Judea and Jerusalem from the sea coast of Tyre and Sidon, which came to hear him and to be healed of their diseases. And they were vexed with unclean spirits, and they were healed. And the whole multitude sought to touch him, but there went virtue out of him and healed them all. And he lifted up his eyes on his disciples and said, Blessed be ye poor, for yours is the kingdom of God. Blessed are ye that hunger now, for ye shall be filled. Blessed are ye that weep now, for ye shall laugh. Blessed are ye when men shall hate you, and when they shall separate you from their company, and shall reproach you, and cast out your name as evil for the Son of Man's sake. Rejoice ye in that day, and leap for joy. For behold, your reward is great in heaven. The Gospel of the Lord. Praise, Praise be to the Lord Christ. Christ. The Lord be with you. And with thy spirit. Let us pray. Let the saints be joyful with glory. Let them rejoice in their beds. Let the praises of God be in their mouth. Hallelujah. Pray, brethren, that this my sacrifice of yours may be acceptable unto God the Father Almighty. May the Lord receive the sacrifice at thy hand to the praise and glory of his name, to our benefit and that of all his holy church. Amen. Let us pray. We beseech the Lord that the gifts of the offering of the of our Father to his service may be acceptable unto thee for the honor of thy saints, and by that mercy profitable unto us for our salvation. <coughs> The Lord be with you. And with, and with thy spirit. spirit. Lift up your hearts. We lift them up unto the Lord. Let us give thanks unto our Lord God. It is meet and right to the church book. It is very meet and right in our bond and duty that we should at all times and in all places give thanks unto thee, O Lord, Holy Father, Almighty, everlasting God, who in the righteousness of thy saints has given to us an example of godly living and in their blessedness a glorious pledge to the hope of our calling. Therefore, with angels and archangels and with all the company of heaven, we laud and magnify thy glorious name, evermore praising thee and saying, Holy, 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 Lord our God, hosts, heaven and earth are full of thy glory. Glory to thee, O Lord most high. Blessed is he that cometh in the name of the Lord, Hosanna in the highest. Almighty and ever living God, by thy holy apostles taught us to make prayers and supplications and to give thanks for all men. We humbly beseech thee most mercifully to receive these our oblations, which we offer under thy divine majesty, 
He's seeking me to inspire a continual belief in the universal church, in the spirit of truth, unity, and concord. And grant that all those who do confess thy holy name may agree in the truth of thy holy word and live in unity in godly love. Give grace, O Heavenly Father, to Shane, our primate, to Stephen, our bishop, to all bishops, priests, and deacons, that they may both by their life and doctrine set forth thy true and lively word and rightly and duly administer thy holy sacraments. We beseech thee also to save and defend this our country and grant to Joseph, the President of the United States, and to Kim, the Governor of this state, and all others in civil authority, wisdom and strength to know and to do thy will. And we beseech thee so to direct and dispose the hearts of all Christian rulers, that they may truly and impartially administer justice to the punishment of wickedness and vice, and to the maintenance of thy true religion and virtue. <clears throat> and to all thy people give thy heavenly grace, that with meek heart and due reverence they may hear and receive thy holy word, truly serving thee in holiness and righteousness all the days of their life. And we most humbly beseech thee, thy goodness, O Lord, to govern and succor all those who in this transitory life are in trouble, sorrow, need, sickness, or any other adversity. <clears throat> And we commend unto thy merciful goodness this congregation which is here assembled in thy name to celebrate the commemoration of the most glorious death and resurrection of thy holy Son. And here we do give unto thee most high praise and hearty thanks for the wonderful grace and virtue declared in all thy saints from the beginning of the world, and chiefly in the glorious and most blessed ever Virgin Mary, Mother of thy Son, Jesus Christ, our Lord and God, and in the holy patriarchs, prophets, apostles, and martyrs, those examples, O Lord, and steadfastness in thy faith, and in keeping thy holy commandments, grant us to follow. We commend unto thy mercy, O Lord, all other thy servants, who are departed hence from us with a sign of faith, now to rest in the sleep of peace. To these, O Lord, and the world who rest in Christ, we beseech you to grant a place of refreshment, of light, and of peace. And God save to grant unto us some portion of fellowship with thy holy apostles and martyrs and with all thy saints, within this company we beseech thee to admit us. Therefore, Almighty God, our Heavenly Father, who with thy tender mercy didst give thy only Son, Jesus Christ, who suffered death upon the cross for our redemption, who made there by his one oblation of himself once offered, a full, perfect, and sufficient sacrifice, oblation, satisfaction for the sins of the whole world, and to institute, and in his holy gospel command us to continue a perpetual memory of that his precious death and sacrifice until his coming again. We beseech thee to hear us, O merciful Father, for thy Holy Spirit and word, God's sake, to bless and sanctify these thy gifts and creatures of bread and wine, that they may become for us the body and the blood of thy most dearly beloved Son, Jesus Christ. When the same night that he was betrayed took bread, when he blessed and given thanks, he break it and gave it to his disciples, saying, Take, eat, this is my body which is given for you. Do this in remembrance of me. Likewise, after supper, he took the cup. And when he had given thanks, he gave it to them, saying, Drink ye all of this, for this is my blood of the New Testament, which is shed for you and for many for the remission of sins. Do this, as often as ye shall drink it, in remembrance of me. Son, our Savior, Jesus Christ, we thy humble servants to celebrate and make here before thy divine majesty. With these thy holy gifts which we now offer unto thee, the memorial thy Son hath commanded us to make, having in remembrance his blessed passion and precious death, his mighty resurrection and glorious ascension, rendering unto thee most hearty thanks for the innumerable benefits procured unto us by the same. Entirely desiring thy fatherly goodness, Mercifully to accept this our sacrifice of praise and thanksgiving, most humbly beseeching you to grant that by the merits and the death of thy Son, Jesus Christ, 
and through faith in his blood, we and all thy whole church may obtain remission of our sins and all other benefits of his passion. And here we offer representatives of thee, O Lord, ourselves, our souls, and bodies, to be a reasonable, holy, and living sacrifice unto thee, humbly beseeking thee, that whosoever shall be partakers of this holy communion may worthily receive the most precious body and blood of thy Son, Jesus Christ, and be fulfilled with thy grace and heavenly benediction, and made one body with thy Son, Jesus Christ, that he may dwell in us, and we in him. You know, though we are unworthy through our manifold sins to offer unto thee any sacrifice, yet we beseech thee to accept this our bounden duty and service, and command these our oblations by the ministry of thy holy angels to be brought up thy holy tabernacle before the sight of thy divine majesty, not weighing our merits, but pardoning our offenses. Through Jesus Christ our Lord, by whom, with whom, and in whom, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all honor and glory be unto thee, O Father Almighty, world without end. Amen. Amen. Let us pray. As our Savior Christ has commanded and taught us, we are bold to say, Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name, thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom, the power, and the glory, forever and ever. Amen. Deliver us, and beseech thee, O Lord, from all evils past, present, and to come. And at the intercession of the blessed, glorious, and ever Virgin Mary, Mother of God, with that of thy blessed apostles Peter and Paul and Andrew and the forty martyrs of Samus, Aidan, and all thy saints, favorably grant peace in our time, and by the help of thy mercy, never be kept free from sin, and saved from all disquietude. To the same Jesus Christ, thy Son, our Lord, who with thee in the unity of the Holy Spirit liveth the reign of God, world without end. Amen. The peace of the Lord be always with you. Nice spirit. Thank you, Lord, Jesus Christ. Also for the O Lamb of God, take us away the sins of the world. Have mercy upon us. O Lamb of God, who takes away the sins of the world, have mercy upon us. O Lamb of God, who takes away the sins of the world, grant us thy peace. We do not presume to come to this side table, o merciful Lord, trusting in our own righteousness. But in thy manifold and great mercies, we are not worthy so much as to gather up the crumbs of thy table. Thou art the same Lord, the prophet he is, always with mercy. Grant us, therefore, a gracious Lord, so to eat the flesh of thy dear Son, Jesus Christ, and to drink his blood, that our sinful bodies may be made clean by his body, and our souls washed with his most precious blood, and that we may ever more dwell in him, and in us. Amen. Take away the sins of the world. The body of our Lord Jesus Christ, which was given for thee, preserve thy body and soul unto everlasting. 
body of our Lord Jesus Christ, which was given for thee. Preserve thy body and soul unto everlasting life. Blood of our Lord Jesus Christ, which was shed for thee. Preserve thy body and soul unto everlasting life. have eaten of love and have drunk, sleep to my animal soul, and grant that no spot of sin remains within me, whom is pure and holy sacrament after your fashion. The Lord has reigned us. Almighty and ever-loving God, we most heartily thank thee for the time that God saves to feed us, who have duly received his holy mysteries with the spiritual food to the most precious body and blood of thy Son, our Savior, Jesus Christ, and thus assure us thereby thy faith and goodness towards us. And we are very members and martyrs in the mystical body of thy Son, which is the blessed company of all faithful people. And our affairs to hope of thy everlasting kingdom, thy merits to his most precious death and passions. And we only beseech thee, O Heavenly Father, Father, so to assist us with thy grace, that we may continue in that holy fellowship and do all such good works as thou hast prepared for us to walk in. Through Jesus Christ our Lord, to whom we and the Holy Ghost be in honor and glory, world without end. Amen. I say unto you, my friends, be not afraid of them that persecute you. The Lord be with you. And with thy spirit. Let us pray. Grant to us, we beseech thee, Lord, at the intercession of thy forty holy martyrs of Sebas, that we who with our outward lips are partakers of this holy sacrament may inwardly receive the same impurity of heart. Through Jesus Christ, thy Son, our Lord, who live in the reigns of the immunity of the Holy Spirit, ever one God, world without end. Amen. Let's pray. <clears throat> Mighty God, we entrust all who are dear to us, thy never failing care and love, for this life and the life to come, knowing that thou art doing for them better things than we can desire or pray for. Through Jesus Christ, thy Son, our Lord, who live in the reigns of the immunity of the Holy Spirit, ever one God, world without end. Amen. Peace of God, which passes all understanding. Keep your hearts and minds in the knowledge and love of God and of His Son, Jesus Christ our Lord. And the blessing of God Almighty, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit be amongst you and remain with you always. Amen. Depart in peace. Thanks, Thanks be to God. God.